Mm. Hello, my geniuses. Guess what? I have another exciting show for you. You know, there is always this question and this big competitive spirit among Jamaicans. They've always been asking which college in Jamaica is the best. Well, my geniuses, tonight we will answer that question. With me, I have many of the colleges in Jamaica. And if you do not hear the name of your college, then what you can do is join my winners from this trivia next week to see if you can beat them in the master's round. Now guys, represented, I have Catholic College of Mandeville. Woo -woo! I also have Bethlehem Teachers College. Yay! <laughs> With us is Sam Sharp Teachers College. Guys, we know they're always claiming that they're the best, so naturally they would be here. Micah Teachers College. Woo! <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? She, has, she already has a plaque card. All right, and not to be left out is the College of Agriculture, Science and Education. Hey! Wow! <laughs> All right, guys. Now I know you want to know their names. So starting with Shernet, she's going to tell you her name and the college that she is representing. Shernet, go right ahead. Good evening, everyone. I am Shernet Whittingham, and I represent Sam Sharp Teachers College Okay, hey, the lady's on a business mission. She's not in any love talking. Tarina, come better than that. Sure, what you have. Hey, guys, I'm Tarina Sheriff representing the Catholic College of Mandeville. And I must emphasize the Catholic College of Mandeville. <clears throat> That's what I'm talking about, girl. Next, we have Sheena. Hey, guys, I'm Sheena. And I'm representing the Michael University College, and I'm here to take the crown. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we have Sadie. Hello, everyone. I am Sadie Warren, and I represent the best college in Mandeville, the best college in Jamaica, the Catholic College of Mandeville. Woo! <laughs> You go, Sadie. Show them what you're made of. Oh, hi, everyone. I am Francine Maxfield, and I'm representing CASE, the College of Agriculture, Science, and Education, and I will be definitely taking this crown tonight. Hey, what I'm talking <laughs> about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Janine? <laughs> <laughs> My name is Janine Angus, representing the College of Agriculture, Science, and Education. Uh, you heard her. Hi, guys. I'm Moya Percy, representing the only college in Jamaica. Yes. <laughs> you heard it. Now, my geniuses, you are going to tell me. Who are you rooting for? Is it Catholic College of Mandeville or is it Bethlehem Teachers College? Will it be Sam Sharp Teachers College for you? Or you want to lean to the side of Micah Teachers College? Or guys, will it be CASE, the College of Agriculture, Science and Education? It's up to you. As usual, you're going to help me to be the judge, okay? Okay, here are the rules. So guys, I will be asking you some questions and you are going to write your answer on the paper. Please do not forget that, okay? So you will write your answer on the paper and hold it up quickly so that I can see. It's the first correct answer that will be given a point for your college. All right, now there are two questions that I will ask you and you will just have to use your wit and intelligence and represent your college well to answer those two. <laughs> but don't even think about those. Those will be at the end. All right, I am about to begin. Are you ready, my geniuses? I can't wait for this. I am ready. Okay, guys, your first question. 
which team does LeBron James play basketball for? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Can you see my answer? And case is in one. It is indeed Lakers. Hold it back some more, Janine, so they can see. Yes, case, you are at one. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, did you see that? I almost fainted because I thought it was an easy one. I'm Jamaican. I'm older. Thank <laughs> <Right? Are> you. <laughs> question. So give the gender for these. Remember, speed question, you'll have to write. Baby. <laughs> Anybody else want to go? I see. Mute. I see. Neutral. Uh I said, ding, 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 ding. Janine again with the, with the answer. Guys, the answer is common gender. So for okay. baby, it is common gender. So Case, you are at two points. And fair. Pull up there. <laughs> <laughs> I just realized what I did. <laughs> All right, never mind. <laughs> We are still looking at gender, guys. Now, you are going to give me the gender for box. For what? Box. All right. Ding, 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 ding. And Charlotte, you have gotten a point. So, Sam Sharp, Sam Sharp, you are on the board with one. Your next one. Still a gender question, guys. Cousin. What's the gender for cousin? For what? Cousin. Very good, Janine. And Case, you are at three. Oh my gosh, Case came to dominate this show today. All right. Your next question is still a gender question? Yes, I'm keeping you in the gender for a little while. If you're my geniuses, you would have known these answers because they were posted on my channel this week. All right. No. <laughs> Now, guys, what is the gender for widower? Let me go again. Masculine. All right, Moya, you got that correctly, but guess what? Charlotte had her answer up first. So the point goes to Sam Park Teachers College. It is indeed masculine. Ding, 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 ding. I you can't write so fast enough. I can't write, can't write male even, or female. Even if, if I can't, can't rec up. even if, if, if it's just MASC, I'll recognize it and you'll get okay, it. Okay, 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 okay. Right, your next gender question, and it's only two to go because I see some people are not into genders, but your next <laughs> gender question, what is the gender for cow? Ding, 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 ding. Sam Sharp is no case at three. Charlotte, congratulations. You right, to write them already. <laughs> <laughs> I just put up one. <laughs> to write them already, Charlotte. You have, you have masculine and feminine. <laughs> yeah. to write them already, Charlotte. You couldn't your write final, them. Your final gender question, guys. What is the gender for stick? And again, it is Charnet for Sam Sharp Teachers College. So she's at four. All right, my geniuses, just in case you have forgotten, please remember that. Masculine gender, that has to do with male, male. creatures. Feminine, feminine gender has to do with female creatures, right? And now common gender, whether it be male or female. So it can be male or female, baby, cousin, children those are common gender mm -hmm. no, yeah. gender are neither male, male or female, or female. And they are lifeless all yes. right? yeah yeah so, guys we are jumping into it let us continue if the verb is compose what is the noun 
Ding, 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 ding. Oh, I saw did that you? piece, but Shernet went a little bit first. Oh, <laughs> Janice went first. Janice went first, Shernet. If it wasn't Janice, my geniuses will tell me that. But I'm almost sure I saw Janice first. <laughs> okay, Jen, because so I love you. I won't quarrel. <laughs> You are on the board with one. Your next question, guys. And we're still looking at verbs and nouns. If the verb is deliver, the noun is? <laughs> Very good job, Janice. Ding, 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 ding. And you are at two representing Bethlehem Teachers College. Irina, I saw that, sweetie. I just want you to write faster and stop focusing on the oh. trip. I know oh, you're see see I'm doing. I know you've been getting those answers. <laughs> don't think I don't see you. But the thing is, you are writing too nice. So it's taking too long. All right, your next question. And this is a final verb noun question. If the verb is produce, what is the noun? Very good job. Ding, 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 ding. Janice, you are tied with case now. We are jumping out of oh, the... No, sir. Let me not think of me first. Go up a while ago. You sure sell me one first, but don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> My genius, they said that they were the first ones. Are they attacking me? I know yes. they're not. Because they know you are there and you are 1,630 strong. So they wouldn't do that. They would not attack me. All right, guys, your next question. You are going to correct the sentence for me. Since you're writing it, it's okay yeah. for you to only write the correct word. All right? So here is the sentence. I done it all by myself. You must see this now, Kadian. Yes, Moya, but you still went up a little later than Janice. <laughs> Janice was first. I did it, so you're all correct there. I did <laughs> it all by myself. Now, one more. Jack Rose is hat to Mrs. Wilkins. Jack Rose his hat to Mrs. Wilkins. And you see? Again, it's Janice. Again, oh, it's yeah, Jenny. it's Jenny's. It's true. It's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> guys, guys, I am honest. I wouldn't be cheating. Just are you cheating? Are you cheating? on her board? Jenny, you need to sure. hold on her board and put it up when she writes her answer because her board is up even without the answer. So by the time we must be for paper, oh, this, Jenny, you turn. Writing <laughs> turn. Guys, that is what make you great teachers. Strategy. You have to strike, guys. <laughs> All right, your next question. And I am happy that I am done with that. No. In which country can I find Niagara Falls? Ding, 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 ding. Very good job, Moya. You were first. So case is at four. It is indeed Canada. It is indeed Canada. Your next question. Now, many of us are familiar with the University of the West Indies in Jamaica. Give me one other country that you can find another campus on. Very good job, Moya. I saw it this time. Indeed, Barbados and Trinidad, you were all correct, guys. But Moya went first. So Kay One point for everybody. <laughs> so Case is at five. No. Mm -hmm. Not fair. Wait, Charlotte, you want to take over my program? <laughs> <laughs> you want to be the host? <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Your next question. Okay, guys, guess what? Shortwood decided that they would not be left out. So represent them, we have Sharon Bogle. And it's not too late for her to win this competition and to join the Masters League for next week. So guys, let us see if Sharon can come and take it all. All right, guys, your next question. You will 
you will have to unscramble these letters. So here goes, your letters are E, V, T, S, I, U, R, N, Y, I. What's the word? A wicked girl. University. Very good job, Sheena. She's supposed to write it. I'm supposed to write it. Ding, 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 ding. Be said first. Remember, yes. remember the rules, Kay. Janine, you said it, but you weren't following the rules. Exactly. I it. Sheena, you are on the board with the Michael Teachers College at one. All right. Your next question, guys. When the wind blows hard and fast, it is called a <laughs> my genius is, you know what? I have no choice except to give Janine and Shernet. Shernet, you have hurricane, and that would not be wrong. But what I was looking for is storm. So I'm gonna give one to case. Aunt, thank you. One to Sam Sharp. So, Case, you're now at six. Sam Sharp, you're at five. Bethlehem Teachers College is at five. Michael is at one. But don't worry, guys. For those who haven't started on the board yet, you still can win. <laughs> Guess what? There is one question that values five marks. So, let's go. Oh, my let's God. Continue. Your next question. <laughs> what is the do I have any singers in the house? Yeah. All right, Mogul. What is the name? And if you get this, guys, you will. So the person that gets this question correctly, you will yeah. have to actually sing the part of the song. So okay. if you have no intention of singing, don't get it correctly. I'm warning you. Now, what is the name of the artist? To which this song belong? Where will we go? Copy. All right. Copy, copy, copy. All right. Supposed to write. All right, Janine, you didn't copy. write it, so she wrote it. So it is. <laughs> copy. Copy. So Michael. I'm on the Zoom, Sydney. Okay. But did you say we could sing it? Oh. Or sing you it will it sing it after. <laughs> I can sing it. All right. But guess what? Hold on. Can I give it to Janine as well? My five marks, no? The rules, the rules. <laughs> it's me like on a fight or kiss, but it's all right. Come, Maya. <laughs> all right, Sheena, go ahead and sing it. Where will we go? Where will we go? When, when the quarantine done and everybody touch oh. road. <laughs> I don't even know the rest of it. Um, I know I'm feeling you. You know you're feeling me. Nobody else can sing. Hey, Come on, hey, yeah. Come, let's go. Sing it, Janine. Sing it. I'm give you your point. <laughs> Where will we go? When the quarantine thing done and everybody touch road. Mummy, me gonna ask her, pull up in a fast car. And it make you on the bus part. I know you're feeling me. You know, I'm feeling you. Reading the lyrics. What now we feed up, baby. Hey, fancy. Oh, your heart say you're not my vacancy. Last night, see you on FaceTime, mashing up the plate, but you know our relation. Me, I go put you on lockdown. Put your body on lockdown, <laughs> etc. All right, guess what? <laughs> yeah, good going. Yeah, good going. She deserved that extra point. I would have given her two, but then you'd hear that I am biased, and you know Kadian isn't biased, right, my geniuses? All right, guys, <laughs> your next question. That was beautiful. Thank you, Sheena and Janine. You were both given a point for that. Your next question. If I speak more than three languages, I am considered. All right, I see bilingual from Sheena. I see poly mm. uh -huh. polyglot. Uh -huh. Yes, Miss Linguist. But the answer that I am looking for is multilingual. I have it up. I have it up. 
I have Yes, you have it too. I saw you, but Moya, you're writing too cute. I don't understand. Mega yeah. protein. I know Janine is going to go for all our linguistic journals now from the University of the West Indies to protest on this one. Janine, yeah. I guarantee yeah. it. I look the answer up. And if it is indeed correct, which I assume it is, it, it is, but I was looking for multilingual. But I have multi up. Yes, no but Shani tied it up before you, Moy. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, mm -hmm. You are on the board again at six for some sharp teachers college. The only college leading you right now is case with seven. Uh, Polyglot. Teachers college, Janice. Polyglot, sorry. Polyglot, no. A person who knows and is able to use several languages. Uh, all right, guess what, Janine? <laughs> you <be> given... <laughs> this is serious. Did you hear that, guys? I can't believe this. I have never had this on my program yet. But Janine, you have gotten another point. So, okay. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. Just wow. Guys, your next question. No. Please think about this carefully. You're going to give me the name of a country that begins with C and it's people eat iguana lizards and they speak hey, seven, and they speak seven different languages. How many? Seven different languages. No guy. Mm. Uh-uh. Ding, 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 ding. Janine again, guys. She came for the kill. Whoa. It is indeed Curacao. It mm. is that would have been my next viewer. Curacao. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. This is a question that Catholic College of Mandeville can knock everybody out the water right now. Your next question, guys. You are supposed to give me the name of one country in the Middle East. One country in the Middle East. Sam Sharp, you still can win this. Very good oh, job, Janice. I saw you, Moya, as well. I think it was a tie between Janice, Moya. Janine, I saw your answer after, but it's Janice and Moya. So one, oh, but either way, Case gets another point, and Janice, you get one. So yes, all those were correct, guys. Great job. All right. I thought we were supposed to speak. No, they wrote it. Oh, not for this. My humblest apologies, sweetie. I did say not these questions as yet. So you see how imperative, imperative it is for the teacher to be explicit in their directions? <laughs> huh? Student wasn't listening. You weren't listening. <laughs> then, I'm not, I'm right. Read my mind, Trini. Read my mind. Peace and love on Reading Unlimited with Katie Ed. Your next question. Who was given the title of Miss World 1993? Lisa Hanna. <laughs> I heard Miguel, but Miguel, mm -hmm. the rules specifically stated that you had to show your answer up. All right, so now I'm going to give case a point. I'm giving no, 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 no. I was the first one who put up my a point. Um, my <laughs> a point and Charnet a point as well. So I don't get a point. Janice, I did say Janice. Who else said I don't get a point? Oh, you did. Oh, I did. <laughs> So guys, I have given you each a point because um, Miguel answered and I was there focusing on his voice and I didn't realize which one went up. <laughs> Just be honest. Knife is to fork as bun is to... As what? Please repeat. Knife is to fork as bun is to... Ding, 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 ding. Janice and Sadie. So Sadie, definitely yeah. you are right. on the board. Finally. College of Mandeville, Toyota, BMW, Benz, Hondas, Mitsubishi's are all. You know what? I'm going to take Sadie's answer. So Sadie was the first one to say car. See, Sheena, I saw yours as well. 
they don't have to be cars. They don't have to be cars. There must be vehicles. Be it would have been, guys, you hear them? I feel like I feel so attacked. <laughs> but it can be cars. Thank you. Guys, because it is not a plane. You know what? I wouldn't put motor <laughs> as the answer. I would put vehicle brand names. You know, I was just about to say that. Yes. <laughs> That's why I took down my answer. Yeah. So I would have done that. So I am going to go ahead with Catholic College of Management. The make. And Sorry. Unfair. We're not top argue. <laughs> Sherni, that was for you, Sherni. Then I stop arguing. All right, guys, tell me when I'm going yeah. to do my program because somehow I don't feel as if I am I am in charge here again. <laughs> Let's go, Miss Morgan. Your final speed question, guys. Yes, Sheena is hungry. She just came straight from work and just jumped on for me. Thank you, Sheena. You're looking beautiful. And all of you guys, thank you so very much for coming on. All right, your next question. Who is the author of the book, The Immigrant Child? <laughs> it was, it was Charlotte that went up first. Sheena, I thank saw you in second, but it was Charlotte. Well, I promise you. you. I promise you. So, so okay. We are gonna so leave. Okay. We are gonna leave the comment. We are gonna leave the, 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 the viewers to, to, to make that selection. Yes, I saw yes. yours as well, Sadie. Guys, in case so if they don't have the book, they don't get the point. Whoa! See what they, I'm talking they don't about? Have the book, they don't get the point. Mine is in my car. Mine will be delivered oh. on Monday. <laughs> you want me to pull up my Amazon account? Then you the receipt. Turn it, be quiet. Turn it. <laughs> All right, guys. So as you can see, yes, that's my book, The Immigrant Child. And if you have not yet purchased it, it's on Amazon. So you can go there. And I would refer you to the hard copy. That is so much more durable. Of course, the paperback is just as beautiful but it's up to you all right so please go ahead and purchase my book it is lovely i guarantee it all right guys your next question and this question is not a speed question and everybody will have to respond all right verbally verbally yes uh, listen mm -hmm. okay miguel let's your it's your time what makes your college the best college in jamaica where's sadie i'm not seeing you sweetie no. I'm here, honey. Okay, great job. Now we are going to begin with Sharon Vogel, and she is representing Shortwood <laughs> Teachers College. Go ahead, Sharon. And remember, guys, this point, this question values five points. So, Sharon, you still can win this. Okay, I would just say that. My college was the best college because the sisterhood we shared is um, the second to none. All right, guys, you heard it for Sharon. And Sharon is representing Shortwood Teachers College. Next, we have Tarina. And Tarina is representing Catholic College of Mandeville. Go ahead, Tarina. My college is the best college based on the teachers, the quality teachers they produce. Sadie's over there killing it, plus we in Jamaica here, plus the encouragement we receive when we're failing and at the point of breaking or giving up, they're always there for you. And the platforms that they expose us to. Uh, one just mentioned the sisterhood. Sadie and I have been friends for 12 years. And we're so lucky that we're, uh, we're a part of the college every year atmosphere, every year, day to day, and how efficient and effective. Ding, 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 ding. Now you make me want to cry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, you heard it. That was quite touching. Uh, Tarina is one to beat. Now, let me take a representative from Case. Francine, why is <laughs> college the best college in Jamaica? Okay, Case is the best college in Jamaica because of the 
holistic teachers that they produce, the quality teachers, the well-rounded teachers who are technologically savvy, who know how to engage their students fully, the encouragement that they gave us from in college and how they really produce us to go out there and face the world with full charge and be the best that we can wherever we go. So we impart that knowledge on our students and we make them very well-rounded and holistic individuals to function wherever they go. And the love that we share between each other as um, college mates and as friend and the link that we continue and the support that we give okay. each other towards <laughs> over a lifetime. <laughs> You will continue that on another episode. Guys, you heard Francine. She wouldn't stop. This lady is passionate about her college. No, yes, I am. Um... Let me hear from Shernet. And Shernet is representing. Sam Sharp Teachers College. Go ahead, Charlotte. Okay, so Sam Sharp Teachers College is the best college in St. James <laughs> because it was named, well, it came about in honor of our national hero, Sam Sharp. And as such, it creates persons who are strong and will fight, not literally fight, but, but go the extra mile to meet everyone's needs. All right, Janice, you will not be left out. Show them what Bethlehem teachers Sorry. are made of. <laughs> Our Bethlehem Moravian College is the best college in Jamaica because mm -hmm. it produces teachers that are creative, teachers who are all-rounders, teachers who are masters at what they do. And Bethlehem does not just train teachers, it creates families to that bond for life. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, oh, oh. All right, Moya, tell us why your college is the best college in Jamaica. This is the best college in Jamaica because of the wide range of courses that are offered there. Um, it is also good for helping its students adapt to new circumstances. If you have survived the case, you can survive anything. You can go anywhere, be anything that you want to be. And the atmosphere also creates that sense of camaraderie that even now after 19, 20 years after leaving case, I can run into a case site that I went to case with and it's like we just left each other the day before. Case is just simply the best. Oh my God. Oh, case. Okay. See, guys, Amen. Amen. Better than all. Carrying case on, she is supportive of case. All right, Sheena, let me hear what you have to say. Why is your college the best? Be Michael. From you hear the word be Michael, you know what's coming. You know that we are diverse and we are equal. Everybody's equal. We don't see anybody as different. Everybody's just under one umbrella and we're centralized. We're in Kingston and we have the good road. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, this girl will pull out all the stops. I'm going to hear from Miguel. Miguel, why is your college the best college in Jamaica? <laughs> well, I, I don't know if I can, I can actually state that claim. Um, I went to Edna Manley College of Visual and Performing Arts. Um, I suppose best is really dependent on what it is that you were hoping to achieve when you went there. But having gone there, um, I must say that whilst there I met some of the most free-spirited, creative, and in intellectual individuals I've ever come across. Uh, persons who weren't afraid to you know, reject social and religious dogmas that they'd been taught all their lives. And um, I suppose, you know, it sort of affirmed some of the beliefs that I had been developing from high school. And it allowed me to, it, so unlike all the other co colleges that I've heard mentioned so far, it was never about camaraderie. It was always about the individual. 
because as an artist, there is no collaboration. It's just you. Because art is, by, by, by and large, a masturbatory act. You ultimately satisfy yourself first before you satisfy anybody else. Guys. So it was a very selfish environment, but it was an environment that we, as artists, we thrived in. Guys, thank you, Miguel. You heard it from the man himself, Miguel Gonzalez, and he is representing Edna Manley College of Visual and Performing Arts. All right, we are moving right ahead. Janine, it's your Janine. time. Why is your college the best college in Jamaica? <clears throat> All right, so I've heard everybody speaking about camaraderie and good roads, but I just have a few things to say. No, at the College of Agriculture, Science and Education, we are privileged not only to be able to see the beautiful North shoreline, but we were also blessed with having two beaches that were full access to students. No, after a hard day's work, we could just stroll on down to the beach, put our bathing suits on, take a swim, and get revitalized and re-energized for the next day's proceedings. Portland is the most beautiful parish bar known. And as such, Case is the most beautiful college campus you have ever laid eyes on. Huh? Yes, so it's the beach for me. It was the beach for me. All right, you heard it, you heard it guys. Now, Sadie, tell us all about it. Why is your college considered the best college in Jamaica? Okay, so Catholic College of Mandeville, CCM, creative, caring, creative teachers, caring teachers, model teachers. In addition to that, it is located in the cool, cool hills of Mandeville. It, um, it produces strong-willed teachers, exceptional teachers. It is student-teacher friendly. It is Christ-like. It produces quality teachers. And it is an amazing institution to be a part of. Ah, this one is going to be a hard one to judge. I am going to move right ahead with the final question. So this is the final question, guys. If you won 50 million US dollars, would you keep your job or quit? All right, the first person to go is Miguel. 20 seconds, Miguel. I'm sorry, would I keep my job? Yes, or you'd yeah. quit? The answer would be quit. Why? Uh, it, I don't think it would make much sense uh, because on average, that would equate to about 25 years salary based on what we're being paid now. Um, or just a, or a little bit more than 25 years. It would be countless for me to spend uh, another 25 years uh, doing the same thing. So, you know, why not retire? Okay, all right, Miguel, thank you very much. Now, Sadie, would you keep your job or quit? Q U I T. Uh -huh. <laughs> all right, so I, why? Go ahead, so, Sadie. So, I wouldn't, um, as much as I love teaching, um, it, it isn't something that I'd want to do after winning all that money. Yes, I would use some of it to contribute to educational institutions. But for me, physically um, getting up in the morning, going into a classroom to teach some fourth graders, I'm quitting. All right, Sheena, what would you do? I would keep my job because I wouldn't want anybody to know that I won so much money. So I keep my job and continue working. And I will, I will definitely assist all my students at my school that, as greatly as possible. Okay, Definitely. Janice, what would you do? If I want so much money, the honest <laughs> truth is I would not quit my job just yet. I would give it some more years just to keep myself out of the public eyes. 
So I would just, I would keep my job for a while, quit after some time, but to keep myself out of the public eyes, to be private about it, I would still keep my job. All right, All right. Charlotte, what would you do? Well, I, would, I, I wouldn't quit, but I'd work Tuesdays, Tuesdays and Thursdays. <laughs> <laughs> would be fired. I, I, yes, I would do a voluntary service. Karina, <laughs> what would you do? I'd be my job. The reason why I love teaching and I teach in a remote school and my students need help. So that's where I'd pull my money to assist the students there and to develop my school. Now I see the Christ like coming out in that Catholic college of Mandeville. You go to Rina. Sharon, what would you do if you want 50 million US dollars? Would you quit your job or would you continue working and why? I would keep my job because I love teaching, but I'd invest the money in stocks and bonds. Okay, then. All right, Francine. Did I call on Francine already? What would you do, Francine? I will definitely quit my job and go and tour the world. Don't give the school some money, of course, because of where I'm working, but definitely quitting my job and arrest this body. Maya, what would you do? I would not, I would quit my job as it exists, but I would create a different job. I'd probably open my own school. All right. Um, and employ different methods of teaching. It would be a very small school. And most of the time I would be busy. I would be employing people to work for me and I'll be touring. (laughs) Janine, what would you do? I'm definitely quitting and I'd pursue my real passion, which is farming. Farming, you go girl. I like that I would eat some Kalaloo right now. Guys, (laughs) on the to my backyard. On that note, I want to thank the representatives from Shorto Teachers College, Catholic College of Mandeville, Bethlehem Moravian Teachers College, Sam Sharp Teachers College, Michael Teachers, Michael University College, Case, the College of Agriculture, Science and Education, Edna Manley College, I want to thank you guys for representing today. Now, my geniuses, you are going to put in that comment section who your winner is. It is based on the amount of comments for the particular college that I will be awarding that college as the winner. And for Mm -hmm. those colleges who are not represented tonight and the University of the West Indies, you will go up against my winners from tonight next week to claim the throne and the trophy. So guys, who will your winner be? Is it Shorthood? Is it Catholic College of Mandeville? Is it Bethlehem? Is it Sam Sharp? Is it Michael? Is it Case? Or is it Edna Manley? You determine. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this trivia. I want to encourage you to continue to look in that mirror. Be positive. Tell yourself something great. You're amazing. You're beautiful. You're talented. You're kind. You're special. Be kind to you. But in so doing, be kind to others. And if you have nothing good to say about people, please say absolutely nothing at all. Now, guys, remember to like, subscribe, comment, and touch that notification button. Okay? Have yourselves a great day. Bye. Guys, thank you for coming on.